Hello everybody, we are going to talk today about uh, how your life starts to change as you progress on this spiritual journey that we're all trying to take part in. Yeah, I think we actually did one kind of like this before, um, so I guess this is more of a another one because kind of we a just follow want up. To, we want to do it, another one. Okay. It's, it's, it's good for people to understand that it's like, uh, it's even if we did it before, good to hear it again hear from other sources over and over and over again let it sink in let it be a part of who you are change for the better well yeah and i think uh i think a lot of people kind of know that this whole earth dimension thing we're all like uh it's like what is it the ascension process we're all going through a and i don't want to say an upgrade but a change in a big change in, in our environment or in the i guess the this realm in general uh there's a lot of changes in our spiritual like dna happening now too uh yeah it's true it's like um and that's why like you'll notice like as things are changing if you are on this path like you if you start to like pull yourself away from media and all these other things like because you're trying to eat better try to eat uh, cleaner you're trying to drink cleaner like you try to get out and be in the sun try to interact with the, the world and you and exist coexist with it instead of like just kind of being a part of it it's like you actually are becoming one uh a lot of the things that people talk about you don't even oh, you recognize mean, anymore you mean we don't you mean like yeah for, for us so yeah um i guess we're to the point now where we don't even watch tv or look really much of the news or if we do it's like you're literally the outside outside just looking in like oh look look what's going on in the world right now because the thing is most of it is there to um, scare people and freak people out and get people riled up or whatever like I couldn't even tell you what the current media is right now but I think this is this is really important for uh, this whole spiritual growth journey that a lot of people are on right now or like uh, expansion in your consciousness is to kind of completely detach from the media until you come to a place uh, where my see my spiritual teacher says where your neural system is strong your neurological system is strong enough to like when you do come back to that stuff you uh, it doesn't phase you at all um, and it shouldn't phase you because most of it's fake and it's there to try to phase you so disconnect from it until you're ready to just look at it from like oh there's that stuff going on over there right yeah i mean uh but a part of that also is like you're gonna start to not be able to interact with people like you used to because a lot of people what they like to talk about is what they see on tv or hear on the news or whatever or like different um media outlets of different kinds like did you see this scary movie or did you see what happened so and so or like and that stuff doesn't actually even mean anything to you anymore so you can't even relate and then you start to like realize even close family members seem like just strangers to you at least that is that that's what's happening with us at least <laughs> who knows what what might happen individually to you but. well it seems like it's a pretty common theme because it's like once you start to go down that path it's like a lot of those people like the whole van life and stuff like that it's like they really just disconnect it's like if it was still like close relations with their families and stuff like that they'd be bringing like their sisters and brothers and mothers and fathers with them wouldn't they maybe <laughs> yeah it's it's a it's a it's a differently uh, interesting place to be it's like it's at first when you I, at least for me personally when i got to that point it's a little bit lonely at first i was glad my partner in crime is with me on this but it's like i don't really have anything to say to my family and friends anymore except for like uh hey uh how are you doing i mean well, but it, the main thing is that so see the big picture of all this the big picture is that align continuously work to align yourself to your highest like conscious self and that's kind of what i think is this whole what's going on in this whole change in the earth and everything and the dimensions everything's kind of moving to get us all to align to our highest consciousness or our highest purpose or whatever you want to call it and so during that process yeah there's gonna be a lot of changes and maybe people you used to talk to you're not going to talk to anymore but a lot of important things to make sure you're doing along this path is that you are actually connecting to your higher consciousness so you can obviously do this through either meditating or at least having some kind of quiet mind quiet the mind time right so meditation daily if you can right um 
detoxing and keeping your body clean and detox and that means definitely a push toward more of the vegetarian um if you want to do vegan sure but like uh you want to do uh, um what is it vegetarian no cruelty vegetarian food <clears throat> foods yes. okay um pure water so either distilled or something else that you know for sure doesn't have tons of chemicals in it <laughs> and any of your fluids that you drink try to make sure that they are pure and not uh, and even also the fluids that are touching your skin like if you're showering please try to get a filter of some sort yes yes and then uh so detoxing and that means everything you put in, on yourself or in yourself and uh meditating um just disconnecting from the popular world so like tv and all that stuff if you need to um if you get to a po- certain point you don't really have to anymore because you know it's all bs then uh you can do that but uh in the meantime i guess in the beginning of your journey you might want to just disconnect from all that um ideally find some kind of spiritual um connection or if you just connect with your higher consciousness or as much as with something as direct to source as possible that i think would be good right um anything else you can think of uh, that's like the definitely hitting it uh, on the head with that. It's like definitely making sure you take care of yourself. Um, if you're looking for people to interact with, there's definitely lots of people on YouTube and on Facebook and other social media sites that actually are on this same journey and they're looking to branch out because it's like once you start to do this, you start to spread this light and the light starts to like get further and further and the people you actually interact with that allow that space like they start to become more light people as well and it's it's just a good thing for everybody yeah and it's all about it's all about searching for the truth of this world searching for the truth and in realizing that we're this is the oneness we're all in oneness we're all extensions of the source consciousness where this is um just realizing so and i think part of that is to um spreading this like peace what is it peace and love and this oneness holding that uh in your consciousness that that all of this this whole existence is about peace oneness and um the higher source the love of the higher source but carrying that with you and spreading it to the world basically um and i think longer term um like once we get over these get to a place where humanity comes kind of back around and realizes that we need to you know start forming more like sustainable communities and whatnot which will i think we're starting to get there but um but yeah this is uh our in general our channel is for to help people on that sp- spiritual path and there's other channels i think maybe do a little better i don't know if people know hmm. see there's one there's actually quite a few but uh I don't know if you know of any. Aluna Ash is one. Jessica Delmar. Who else? Uh, Archangel Michael. Um, Martin Kinney actually has a lot of good information on uh, kind of the earth structure and uh, the flat earth model and all that stuff. But um, these are all just things you can look into to help to get you to your place of highest consciousness. But uh, And there's obviously many, many others. But Yes. Um, but that pretty much uh, about wraps it up um just definitely try to make sure you do the best for yourself and it'll spread and just make sure to take care of yourselves and take care of each other uh yes and uh where's that can you so this is the uh i think i saw this on archangel michael the other day but uh basically living with this these thoughts in your head it says that okay and so in this moment and always i ask for the greatest good for the earth humanity and all creation and of course, uh, I say Om Shanti 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 at the end. That's uh, completion, basically. Um, yeah, and we'll put our uh, what is it? Our website down at the end because uh, it has some of the 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 environmental detoxing things, like you can make your own soap and all that kind of stuff that people can start doing if they want, um, just to help with living cleaner in general. Because that certainly helps the body to. The cleaner the body, the easier it is to retain this higher vibration, higher consciousness. Um, uh, let's see what else. Well, I think that's it. Uh, so peace out, everyone. Have fun, right? <laughs> oh, yeah.